Aiden O'Connell, the uh, Las Vegas Raiders quarterback, and his receiver, Jacoby Myers, former Patriot, joining us here on set. How are you guys doing? doing great. Oh, good, man. Appreciate you having Thanks me. Thanks for joining Thanks us. Thanks for coming by. First of all, yeah, let's it? just get the pitch out of the way. What do we got? What, 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 do you, what are we pitching here? Yeah, we're here with Bounty. Uh, Bounty's a great product, obviously, during Super Bowl week. A lot of wings being eaten, so Bounty's here to clean up your mess. Exactly. And that, simple as that. All right. We could use those to clean up the mess in Fox. I was going to say, well, well, there we go. I said, this is New England sports show. Something got to be coming. So, so, so Aiden, wait, wait, we are in Boston, so we're, yeah. we're uniquely uh, interested in Jacoby's perspective. Uh, how's it going here in Vegas, Jacoby? You like it? Yeah, I love it, man. It's great. Feel it's like great. Uh, feel like a whole new world, a whole new lease on life? Yeah, it's different, man. It's a lot different from the uh, New England winners, for sure. Okay, well, not just the winners. How about the, the culture of the football and the team and – yeah, do you enjoy it here more than your days in New England? <laughs> I mean, it was different experiences. You know, who I was at that point in my career, I probably didn't get as much respect as I would out here. So I ain't going to lie, I do, honestly. Just, it's different. It's different. I'm, I'm a different person here, so I appreciate that. Different person how? As far as the respect thing. Like, there I really had to prove who I was every day. Like, every single day I had to be better. Not just the same, but better here. I want to be better every single day, so it's different. Do you think they way. use you better here, you know, put you in a – a better place to succeed here? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, not just to call people out or throw anybody under the bus, but I was more of a focus here than I was there. Whereas there, I was more so doing what I had to do to survive and feed my family. Aiden, what would you say his strength is as a receiver? Can, can you tell he's a former quarterback with the way he approaches the game and sees the field? Yeah, I think consistency, reliability. Cobes is always in the right spot. Um, obviously, just great at catching the ball and the, the fundamentals. But um, in terms of understanding the game, understanding what it takes, I think his ability to work hard every day and come to practice with, with an edge is, is really impressive to watch. Why didn't it work in New England? That's, that's At the end, I'm talking, right? I mm -hmm. mean, it seemed like you had a rapport with Mac Jones. Mm -hmm. uh, you were producing there. And given where they ended up in terms of productivity from the position, it certainly seemed that they had a need. Yeah. What happened? They, they just wouldn't budge. You know what I mean? At the end of the day, he didn't want to move. And I, I respect it. Like, it's his job to do what's best for his team or what he thinks is best for the team. It just didn't align with what I felt like I was worth. How close was it? It was. Uh, <laughs> it was How close was New England's offer? To what I got? Yep. A million. It was a million apart? Yeah. And they wouldn't come up? They wouldn't move, no. If they had, if they had come up that one extra million, would you have stayed? I wouldn't have mind staying. I don't know, honestly. I don't, it would have been a different conversation. I probably would have thought about it a little different. But I did enjoy Boston. Like, it was great. The guys that was there, those were really, like, family members to me, man. I really – the receiver room, TB. I still talk to Troy all the time. Like, that's my guy, man. So – it was definitely a sting when I left, but I understand the business side. And, and, and you've tweeted this, so you know, you've talked about it. The, the contract they wouldn't gave, give you, they gave Juju Smith-Schuster. Mm. And you saw how that worked out with him this year. Yeah. Looking yeah. back on that, how do, you, how do you feel about all that? I mean, Juju, at the end of the day, he a man, and I respect him, man. And it has nothing to do with him, Obviously. really. Like he, I think he's a good player. I think football just caught up to him. You know, I, mean, I don't know what his situation is, but... It's tough, man. But, it's you tough. Feel, but you feel vindicated that you were worth what you were asking for with the Patriots and they made a mistake. I do. As far as those lines, yeah, like I do. I feel like now you can see, like, if y'all just freed me a little bit and let me kind of go out there and do other things or make plays and try to really gear it towards me, it would have paid off. How much of a draw for you in choosing the Raiders was Josh? Um, the relationship definitely helped help me buy into it because I understood what I would have to do going into it. You know, and then the offers probably weren't the greatest. Like I didn't have a bunch of other offers. So if you take the comfortability I had with Josh, it was a clear favor at that point. We're joined by Jacoby Myers, former Patriots receiver and his quarterback, Aiden O'Connell here with the Vegas Raiders are here with Bounty. Uh, what happened with Josh this year, do you think? You know, it's my first time in the NFL. So uh, I had one coach in my whole time in college. So I think I was spoiled with that. But um, you know, I think it's it's hard. You you got to win games, and we were close. We were in a lot of games, but um, I I think just the energy around the building with AP has has really been awesome. Yeah, what is it with Antonio Pierce? Like he heard almost immediately. You guys universally well, in the locker room are like, this is the guy. After they made the move, I, was the videos of you guys dancing around the like having I mean, cigars? It, it, it felt like there was a party <laughs> after Josh <laughs> lost the job. Why why was there? A, did, did it get bad at the end with him? I don't think necessarily anything like that. I think it was just guys were frustrated more than anything. I think guys want to win. And I think the leaders on our team especially mm -hmm. um, knew what it took to win and, and wanted to win bad. And so um, for us not to be winning, they knew something had to happen. Okay. You, we're, we're getting the break sign, but Jacoby, before you go, I know you get this all the time from Boston people, but we just have to go back here. 
Do you still think about the pass you threw back to Chandler Jones? Oh, yeah. A couple all, years ago? All the time. Like, it, it low-key haunt me, but in a good way. You know what I mean? I know it won't happen again type situation. So. What were you thinking? I wasn't. You know what I mean? I was, I'm trying to win the game. Like, those decisions be so split second. Like, it ain't too much thought that go into it. It just, all right, we trying to win, get the ball to the quarterback. You know was there I mean? – uh, was that anything you had worked on, anything that you had for that situation, or was that totally out of the blue? Oh, totally out of the blue. Man. Totally out of the blue. So I, I got the ball. I said, I'm not supposed to have the ball here. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. I look for Mac. I see Mac. I don't see Chan. I try to throw it to Mac. It's some other reasons why that didn't work out. But then it just didn't work. Somebody caught it. He scored. Do you think Belichick held that against you? No, nah, I don't think so. I feel like I did a lot much. I mean, I did way more for that team than I did to hurt them, if that makes sense. There are, there are people that have theorized that that was part of the – that's why we ask you. Mm, I mean, if, it, if he did, I will understand why too, but I don't think he did. So all it would take was an extra million and you were still in New England, maybe. Yeah, it was a chance that I would still be in New yeah. England. Yeah, so, okay. Yeah. They, they made a mistake on that one, Jacoby. Thank you for appreciate coming that, by. Man. We appreciate it, guys, okay? Thank you. Listen, thank you. Thank you. All right, we're, we're going to take a quick break and be right back here from the Super Bowl.